coming back here. So it was one year and eight months ago, actually, when we yeah, were here the last time and when we brought our passengers ashore. But uh, let's go a few days earlier, so a few weeks earlier than this date. You know, there are these joyful moments at the captain, like this one here today, um, opening new ships, being here, returning somewhere. But there are also these moments where you can feel all the responsibility on your shoulder, the responsibility for all the persons on board, for our guests, and of course also for our crew. And I have to say the days before coming here to Barbados were some hard days because um, we saw everywhere the doors were closing. And normally you say every port should guarantee a safe haven, but they weren't. And then we came to Barbados and Barbados was open for us and stood to us also in those difficult times. You know, like in a relationship, like in your family, you stand together when it counts. And I think this is so important. And therefore, I'm really so, so thankful. And that is also, you ask, why did I make this message when leaving? Not because of making some nice moments or advertising. It was really coming from my heart because all these people here really supported us and stood up for us and said, we need to support AIDA, we need to support the crew. And not only from the politics and for the management of the port, but also the port workers, everybody from the linesmen, from the pilots, to the taxi drivers bringing us to the airports, to the hospitals, wherever we needed to go, to the port workers helping us in provisioning, bunkering, all these people, all these people helped us and stood by us. And that is really something very special for us, and that is why I want to say thank you again, thank you to all of you for really helping us in these difficult days and standing by us as partners. And um, yeah, now it's the time to return. Now after 610 days, we are back here in Barbados. So I promised I will be back or we will be back bringing back passengers and of course also business to the port. And um, yeah, here we are, not yet with the full ship because we have to take it slowly. We shouldn't rely on, I mean, all our passengers are vaccinated. We do testing and everything still. We have to be very careful, and everybody has to be very careful. The pandemic is not yet over. So we are doing it slowly but steadily, step by step, doing more and more and seeing that we can do it safe because we not only want to protect our business, we also want to protect the places we are going to, the communities we are going to, and of course all the Barbadians. So you can be sure when we are coming, we also like to make it safe and we like to make it yeah, healthy for everybody. So thank you again for welcoming us here, for welcoming Aida Perla here. I think I've never had such a warm welcome in a port. And it was really, you know, this moment when we came here. In the morning, we still had some rain showers. But then it was after like these, I mean, you are living on an island. You know this, when these hurricanes pass by and there's this bad weather for days and weeks. And then suddenly there is this morning when the sun comes over the horizon and it looks like never everything would have happened before. Like it is really a beautiful day, the sea is calm, the sun is coming up, and this was what I was feeling today when I came to Barbados, and I'm so thankful for this. Thank you.